Well, the new pumping system with the uh, gravity drain and this jet has really just gone over the top as far as cleaning. Look how clean the bottom of the pump is. Wind got a little spazzy today, so I had to tie a couple of things up that wanted to flop over. But other than that, I mean, this is just gorgeous. I actually used some of the basil for dinner tonight, made some other tilapia, not these little guys yet, but. Chemical check showed pH at 7.2, which is beautiful for the fish and within the acceptable range that I want to be 6.8 to 7.2 for the plants and the fish. But as you can see, the plants are just cranking. It looks awesome. The lettuce is coming along real nice. Kale is starting to get big. One nice thing about the wind is it showed me that these double stalks had gotten pretty entwined in each other so now you can see how broad the jalapeno plant really is. See, it's still a bit windy. But all in all, it rained a little bit on them. Um, pH 7.2, ammonia barely registering. Just the slightest hint of green in that yellow barely registering. Nitrite is at zero. Nitrates are at 40. So another week of this feeding schedule and seeing if the chemicals stay stable, that's going to tell me that, uh, that we can stock the tank a little bit heavier. So let's say I've got, what, 14 in there right now. We put the smallest uh, Nile tilapia into my daughter's African cichlid tank. And the, basically, they're all the same size. It was looking a little lethargic in the little bucket that I had before, and now it's actually gotten much healthier and a lot more robust, hanging out with other fish at more its size. But I've got 14 in the tank. I could actually push this up to probably 25, but we'll go for 20, so maybe six more fish in the tank. And, uh, but we'll see. Should be able to stock it heavier. Right now, it's not stocked very heavy for 55 gallons. It's only about, uh, Maybe a quarter, a little over a quarter of what could be considered heavily stocked. So heavily stocked, you know, you can push up to a fish per gallon. We don't want to go anywhere near that. I'm thinking two fish or two gallons per fish. So I could be up to the 25 range and still be giving each fish a little over two gallons a piece. We'll just have to see how it goes. Hmm. Whoa, here comes some rain. Okay, well, I'm going to end this, and uh, we'll see you in the morning.